Hello guys and welcome to Linux Studio and in this video I will show you how you can set up and run Tor browser on Linux to access the Tor network. Tor network basically the dark web it is also known by that name. For that we need to have the Tor browser archive file which we can download from the official website. So just head on to torproject.org and uh, here just click on the download button and uh, then click on this Linux mascot icon and the rk file will start to download so it will take a minute or few seconds in my case and as you can see here also that uh, the tor browser is also available on android so you can also download the apk file from here or you can go to the play store to download the application so it's downloaded now so let me just uh, open the file manager so what we need to do now we have to extract this file so you can extract by right clicking or you can choose extract here and the file will get extracted so here as you can see so it's done now and you can also use the command line for this purpose so i'm going to delete this folder the extracted folder i'm opening a terminal here and to extract the file just type uh, so first let me type ls so this is the file that we want to extract and so it's a tar file you can see and it's a tar.xz so to extract this file just type tar then xbf then the file name that is tor browser use the tab key in order to complete automatically hit the enter okay and it, it is extracting the archive file so the b parameter that we used here is for showing these all things that, that we just did so we got the same result like we have the folder here so just open up this folder and you will file this desktop entry and you can run the browser from here as well so just open the terminal you can also cd to this folder directly and type ls so this is the file so it's a green that means it can be executed so to execute a file just type dot and slash and the file name that is a start use the tab key to auto complete hit enter and uh, it will start the tour browser so on the first screen you will see this window pop up so this is saying configure and connect so you don't need to configure anything as of now if you want to do something specifically then you can use this configure button just click on connect and it will set up the network for you the all the config configuration thing it will do automatically so here is the tor browser what it does basically it provides you encrypted multi-layer protection so until you don't do any stupid you will be ghost on the internet no one will ever know what you did on the internet so if i click here so this is not showing anything so let me just open up website that is dugdugo.com so it's a private or privacy concern search engine if i click here now this will say my this is my browser so then the browser connected to the uk some server here in the uk then it connected to an, an server in canada then it connected to a server in latvia or how do you pronounce this then it went to the duckduckgo.com so it is providing us this multi-layer protection so that no one can know what we just did on the internet and uh, earlier in this video i said that there is a tour network that that we can access using this browser so that can be accessed uh, if we type any url with dot onion extension so you have to find out those urls in order to access those files so you can find a post in the description an article so in this article i have linked some of the website of the tor network or the dark bulb so you can click on those links or copy those links and paste here in this browser in order to access those hidden websites they cannot be accessed from your regular browser like i have this opera browser here i cannot access that website using this particular browser because it is not connected to the tor secure network so you can check out that link below also so that was it in this video i hope you liked it if you did then hit that like button and subscribe to the channel i will show you i mean i will see you in the next video till then take care and keep enjoying links bye